So the B2B Create app, you're going to click Add Products. Once that in product screen is loaded, you're going to select Leather Saddle Bag. Okay, so we see here the Leather Saddle Bag. Let's upload an image. Let's go with this Fear and Game. Sounds about cool. Okay, loading. Okay, there we go. So now let's zoom out so we can fit this onto the bag. Ow, ow, ow. Look at that. Jacks or Nightmare for Christmas status. Scarecrow. Sheepers, creepers. All of that. Just all those vibes right now. Okay, we're going to drag this down. Let's preview this image. Okay, so now you're going to see how it looks when it's printed. So you can scroll over, see all the area that's covered, make sure there's no white area. You want to make sure that's especially important. Okay, let's add a title to this. Let's call this Leather Saddlebag. Okay. Next, we're gonna go down to click I have reviewed and approved my designs and then save and publish design. Once we've clicked save and publish designs, it'll take us to our product description page where we can change the title out of product description. So let's type in product description here. Okay, next we're gonna select our collection. So you know what, let's not put this in a collection. We're gonna add our product tags. So we're just gonna do tags, tags, tags. This is just to make it so it's easier, easily searched on the website. And then we'll add our product selling price, $49.99. Click publish products. Now it's gonna load up to our product added successfully page. We're gonna to click to view the product in Shopify, which will take us to our product info backend. Once we get to that end, we can edit different things like product description, product type, vendor type, collections. Um, let's put this in leather saddlebag. We can add it and change images. We can add new tags. We can change the pricing, the inventory, the shipping, add variants if we want. It even gives us a nice little view of our search engine listing. Then you can delete and save the product.